So basically the photo or the sketch is just, it's my blueprint for the painting. And then the hard part is, all it does is kind of stimulate my brain to get me going and then I start painting all the rest of the people in. Cause like, uh, you know, I put Melissa, my wife in the, in the paintings. That's not in the photo. So there's so many, <clears throat> excuse me, so many things that come from out the photo. like you know like this painting there was people sitting at all of these um, seats it was a lot busier here but I just had to, I just wanted to make it more of like a behind the scenes like the calm before the storm before the restaurant got really busy so. yeah that's kind of the older style like this but it seems like it's uh, I didn't even know I was changing but I guess it's the evolution of my style it still looks like my style but I was telling someone earlier if uh, if I was still painting that old square style 15 years later, I think it would get kind of old. You'd be like, oh, he's doing the same style. But some people miss the old style, but then a lot of people, love. I feel I've gotten a lot better too. I've, I've evolved. I always put a little extra pressure on myself to outdo the last year show. Thank one, thank you for coming out, and I'm going to turn it over to Michael so he yeah. can explain the fabulous exhibit that he's brought in for us today. Thanks for coming, guys. It's so awesome. It's all paint by numbers. <laughs> so the idea for this show was I wanted to do a series of called Postcards from Around the World. So it's kind of like uh, places I've been and places I would like to go. Okay. So I was, in essence, painting my bucket list, which is easier than spelling my bucket list. So that's... That's fun, and people can relate to all the places. But I couldn't do that alone. Just me being the talent is not enough. It, it takes, uh, you know, my agent. It takes uh, Gary, his staff, the people that believe in me. You know, I would never be here if, if Gary didn't see my work uh, 15 years ago in New York. And I always told people, if I didn't have, back then when we didn't have digital cameras or if I didn't have my portfolio on me, they would ask, what's your style look like? And I'd say, well, it's kind of like if Monet, Van Gogh, and Cezanne got together and painted bar scenes. That's kind of 